We're going to continue on our journey of the Yoga Sutras. And today we're on Yoga Sutra 136. So book one, verse 36. What we've been doing working up to this verse is talking about lots of different ways to meditate. So 34 was using the breath. 35 was sense perceptions and we did a hand meditation. Um, so it's just kind of going through like these are all the different ways you can work with this practice of steadying the mind. And today's he says, or by concentrating on the supreme ever blissful light within. Pretty short and simple. So the technique is to focus on the light within. So I have a confession to make. When I first started practicing yoga, I thought the chakra stuff was weird. <laughs> I was like, I don't know if I get that part. Um, it's intangible, the idea that we have these energy centers um, throughout our body and that they're different colors and um, that they offer ways to open up certain experiences or qualities or they can be shut down and limit us in terms of access to those experiences or qualities. Um, which is fine. I mean, I don't know that anyone has to believe all the things in order to get good results from yoga. But I was like, not putting much of my attention on that. And this sutra gets a little bit at the idea that there's light within us, whether it's chakras and there are seven different colors or eight, depending on which version you study. Um, but the idea that we're, um, have light quality. And um, over the years since I've been practicing, I've had several experiences where through meditation and breath work, I have had what seems to me like an experience of seeing my chakras from the inside out. So an experience of being in a state of mind where um, I had an awareness of that light. So I share that um, as possibility um, from a, being a skeptic to working enough with all the tools and doing different techniques where I was like, oh, <laughs> real. Um, and the more that I've practiced and the more that I've um, studied these systems, um, the more trust I have in the ancient wisdom around us being light beings, regardless of how esoteric that sounds. Um, and a lot of this is based, um, you know, at a scientific level on the fact that we're made up of energy and energy is light. So there's a kind of a fundamental way we can understand that, like the smallest molecule in our body are vibrating energy. And that when we meditate, um, we might be get still and quiet enough to tune into that level of awareness of self. So my um, meditation that I'm going to lead us through today um, will invite you into some awareness, whether or not you see brilliant light or chakras or just imagine it. I don't know that it, um, I can make any promises or um, that it really matters. What I can offer is that in my own experience, um, being open to the possibility and being curious and trying the things um, might yield some new insight. So that's my invitation. Be curious. All right. So we're going to begin the way I like to begin most of the time, which is to create your posture and close or lower your eyes so that your attention comes more inward than outward. get into the more subtle, get into the really obvious physical experience of your body right now. 
Start with your foundation. So it might be your feet and your seat. of stability and support and I invite you to relax into the support a little bit so that you're giving yourself permission to have some ease in your body do something on purpose with your hands. Notice your breath just as it is. Visualize your breath coming into your body, traveling down the channel of your trachea, your windpipe into your lungs, and then receding and exiting as you exhale. Just an awareness of the breath coming in, filling up, and going out. I imagine the breath as like a body of light coming in and going out. next time you breathe in, visualize that light filling up your lungs and starting to expand, move throughout your body, moving down through your torso and up across your collarbones. Each breath in, expanding the space that the light's taking up, moving down your legs, down into your arms. As you breathe in, the light expands from your 
your center to your periphery. And there's a, a sense of a contraction, a drawing back inward as you breathe out. I'm breathing in, feeling the light expanding to your fingers, your toes. And a softening or a drawing back towards center as you breathe out. You're observing the energy that comes in when you inhale and recedes as you exhale. body filling with that light energy, sense of expansion, and then softly just softening as you breathe out. And you might experience yourself as a gentle expansion and softening of that light energy. Like a pulsation. sense a gentle glow at your skin. Sense into it as an inner warmth. There's a 
central energy channel in our body that runs in parallel with our spine. Then picture a line of energy drawing up parallel to your spine towards the top crown of your head. As you exhale, the energy follows the channel back down to the base of your spine. Follows the energy of your breath moving up and down your spine. goes, your energy flows. So as you draw your attention up and down this central energy channel, there's a possibility of clearing anything that might be stuck. you notice some stuckness, so a little impedance at any point in your breath and energy. curiosity, not judgment or meaning. Using the breath to clear anything that seems stuck. sending breath and light in 
connecting to any dark spots. to your heart center in the chakra system anahata chakra is at the center of your chest so not necessarily your physical heart but your energetic heart expand into a ball or a globe of light. together, we typically close with the word namaste, which can be translated to mean the light in me, acknowledges the light in you. sense of your own light at your heart center, expanding outward towards other beings. generous heart trusting their light to each and every person you meet take this next breath in picture the expansion that comes from a full breath 
expanding out. And when you're ready, open your eyes. Hello, light beings. Let's finish today with a simple namaste. Bring your thumbs to the center of your forehead. Together, let's bow and say namaste. I hope you have a wonderful day. Build with light. Thank you, Kate. You are welcome. Thank you, Kate. <laughs> yes, thanks a lot.